Huskies in crisis. The Norfolk SPCA needs your help. They say several dogs in severe condition landed in their lap and it will cost thousands to treat them. Ten on your side's Lauren Moss explains how you can help. And Regina, just look at these images. These are the Huskies that Norfolk SPCA needs help taking care of. Multiple Huskies were t transported to their facility without their knowledge, but the animal shelter stepped in to make room for the neglected Huskies. The four Huskies came from a backyard breeder and now require extensive medical intervention that will cost the animal shelter thousands of dollars. Money the shelter simply doesn't have. Their medical care going forward will be thousands per animal to do the diagnostics and the treatment for each. The three adult Huskies, Diesel, Lillian, and Scout, are heartworm positive, infected with hookworms and whipworms, dehydrated and underweight. The baby Husky, Ziggy, is likely blind in one eye and has to see an eye specialist. Ziggy was also dehydrated and underweight. Probably really hours away from death had it not been treated with supportive cares. And days later, a woman handed over two more Huskies. She says the same people gave her the dogs in a 7-Eleven parking lot. Bonnie and Viking were treated at the animal shelter, and unfortunately, Viking had to be euthanized. Dr. Rita Hemmings, the veterinarian in charge, says the condition of the dogs didn't happen overnight. These adult dogs were bitten by mosquitoes a minimum of six months ago, so it takes quite quite a bit of time for some of these ailments to come up. And these Huskies are in for weeks to months of medical treatment, treatment that isn't easy on their bodies. The heartworm protocol is a round of three shots that are uncomfortable. They go deep into the muscle um, and they can cause a lot of inflammation in the body. The team at Norfolk SBCA says today is a day they are digging deeper. The dogs will be sedated and given a full medical exam. It could reveal other conditions, diseases, and injuries. But the Norfolk SBCA staff is optimistic about their future. I want them to be happy. I want them to have space to run. And the Norfolk SBCA is asking for your help. The money raised by the Norfolk SBCA will help with the emergency medical care, socialization, and adoption placement. If you would like to help, head over to our website at wavy.com. Lauren Moss, 10 on your side.